Throughout history, surprise has been the ultimate weapon in warfare, turning the tide in battles from Troy to Normandy. The element of surprise has always been a game changer, catching adversaries off guard and shifting the balance of power. In today's world, the skies are the new battlefield, where stealth, strategy and the unexpected matter more than ever. Modern aerial combat demands not just power, but also ingenuity and adaptability. Enter the Saab Gripen, a fighter jet from Sweden, a nation that refused to depend on superpowers for its defense. The Gripen embodies a philosophy of independence and self-reliance. The Gripen isn't about brute force, it's about cleverness, efficiency and operating where others can't. It's designed to be versatile and effective in a variety of scenarios. Imagine pilots in billion-dollar jets, confident in their superiority, suddenly outmaneuvered by a smaller, nimbler adversary. The Gripen's agility and advanced technology make it a formidable opponent. That's the Gripen, a puzzle that even the world's best air forces struggle to solve. Its unpredictability and innovative design keep adversaries on their toes. It challenges the idea that bigger is better, proving that innovation can outmatch size. The Gripen's design is a testament to the power of smart engineering. Sweden, known for neutrality, built one of the world's most respected fighters, one that Russia and others never saw coming. The Gripen's reputation is built on its unexpected capabilities. This is the story of how the Gripen became a silent guardian on the world stage. Its legacy is one of surprise, innovation and strategic brilliance. To truly understand the Gripen, you have to look at Sweden's unique position in the world. Strategically vital, yet perpetually vulnerable, always living next to a powerful neighbor, Russia. For centuries, Sweden has been shaped by its geography, with a long exposed coastline and vast forests that offer both protection and peril. This proximity to Russia has always been a source of tension and caution, influencing every aspect of Swedish defense planning. During the Cold War, Sweden made a bold choice, armed neutrality. It refused to join either NATO or the Warsaw Pact, determined to chart its own course. This meant Sweden had to be ready to defend itself, alone, against any threat, at any time. This commitment to independence meant total self-reliance. No buying jets from the US or USSR, no risking foreign control over spare parts, software or critical technology. Sweden couldn't afford to be dependent on anyone else for its security. Sweden's answer was ambitious. Build everything at home, from submarines to fighter jets, from radars to missiles. This homegrown approach fostered a culture of innovation and resilience, making Swedish engineers some of the most resourceful in the world. The new fighter had to be more than just advanced. It had to handle icy runways, brutal winters, and Sweden's unique Bass 90 strategy. Operating from hidden, improvised roadways deep in the forest, not from big, vulnerable air bases. It needed to be small, rugged, and easy to maintain, able to take off and land almost anywhere, even on short, rough stretches of road. Swedish conscripts, not just professional pilots, had to be able to keep it flying in the harshest conditions. Sweden demanded a true multi-role jet, capable of air combat, ground attack, and reconnaissance, all in one affordable package. It had to be flexible enough to switch roles quickly, adapting to whatever the mission required. The Gripen had to be advanced enough to face off against the latest Soviet jets, yet simple enough for conscript mechanics to repair by the roadside, far from any base. This balance of sophistication and simplicity was a huge engineering challenge. Many experts thought these requirements were impossible to meet. The list of demands seemed endless, and the risks were high. But out of this challenge, the Gripen was born a uniquely Swedish shield built for survival, independence, and the harsh realities of its homeland. The Gripen's origins are rooted in necessity, not just national pride. It's a story of a small country refusing to be intimidated, determined to shape its own destiny. It's a product of a nation determined to control its own fate, no matter the odds or the obstacles in its path. And as history would soon show, the Gripen would prove that with smart design, innovation, and determination, even the toughest odds can be overcome. The Gripen stands out for its size, smaller and lighter than rivals like the F-15 or Su-27. At first glance, it might seem outmatched by these larger, heavier jets, but that compact frame is actually a carefully engineered advantage. But that's its strength, harder to spot. 
more agile, and able to turn tighter in a dogfight. Its small radar cross-section makes it more elusive, and its nimble handling lets it outmaneuver bulkier opponents in close combat. Its powerful engine gives it a superb thrust-to-weight ratio, making it a formidable close-quarters fighter. The Gripen can accelerate rapidly, climb fast, and recover energy quickly after aggressive maneuvers, crucial traits in a high-stakes aerial battle. The real genius, though, is in its brain. An advanced data link system lets Gripens share information instantly, hunting as a coordinated pack. This digital backbone means every pilot knows what the others see, creating a force multiplier effect. This networked approach gives them situational awareness that can overwhelm less coordinated foes. In a modern air battle, information is as vital as firepower, and the Gripen excels at both. Cost is another advantage. The Gripen is far cheaper to buy and operate than most modern fighters. For air forces looking to stretch their budgets, this means more jets in the air and more pilots trained for the same investment. It uses less fuel, needs fewer maintenance hours and can be kept flying by a small ground crew. This simplicity means higher readiness rates and less downtime, even in challenging conditions. For countries with limited budgets, it's a top-tier fighter without the top-tier price tag. Smaller nations can field a modern air force without breaking the bank, leveling the playing field against bigger powers. The Gripen's philosophy is efficiency. Why use a sledgehammer when a scalpel will do? Every aspect of its design is about doing more with less, maximizing impact while minimizing cost and complexity. It wins with intelligence and adaptability, not intimidation. The Gripen can quickly switch roles from air defense to ground attack, Thanks to its flexible systems and smart software, it can operate from places others can't, share data in real time, and stay in the fight longer for less money. Its ability to take off from highways or remote strips means it's always ready, even if main bases are threatened. This blend of agility, technology and affordability makes the Gripen a truly underestimated opponent. It's a jet designed for the realities of modern warfare, not just for show. It's a scalpel in a world of sledgehammers, Precise, efficient, and always ready to surprise. The Gripen's true test comes in the sky, not on paper. In international exercises like Red Flag, the Gripen has played David against Goliath and often won. Against advanced US and Russian jets, Gripen pilots use stealth, data links, and teamwork to outmaneuver and outsmart their opponents. They share targeting data, struck before being detected, and used agility to win simulated dogfights. Even against India's powerful Su-30 MKIs, the Gripen's electronic warfare and tactics gave it the edge. These weren't flukes. They were the result of smart design and training. The Gripen proved it's not just a budget fighter. It's a giant killer. In the hands of skilled pilots, it can defeat the world's best. The Gripen was built with one main threat in mind, Russia, whose air power has long shaped Sweden's defense strategy. Over the Baltic Sea, Swedish Gripens regularly intercept Russian bombers and fighters testing Swedish defenses, pushing the limits of readiness. The Gripen's quick response time and agility often catch Russian crews completely off guard. Its advanced sensors and electronic warfare suites let it track and shadow Russian aircraft without being detected or noticed. Gripen pilots can gather intelligence and send a clear message. Sweden's airspace is protected at all times. These encounters are tense, but the Gripen consistently proves it's more than a match for any challenge. Its presence changes Russia's strategic calculations in the region. Sweden's neutrality is backed by a fighter Russia knows not to underestimate, no matter the situation. Military aviation evolves fast, so does the Gripen. Saab's new Gripen E and F are more than upgrades, they're almost entirely new machines. With a powerful new engine, the Gripen E can supercruise, fly supersonic without afterburner, saving fuel and increasing range. The airframe carries more fuel and weapons, while advanced electronics and radar give it longer reach and better target tracking. The new avionics architecture allows rapid software updates and easy integration of new weapons. Nations like Brazil and Sweden are already receiving these jets, ensuring the Gripen stays ahead of emerging threats. The Gripen EF is a direct answer to stealth fighters and advanced air defenses worldwide. It takes everything that made the original great and elevates it for the future. 
the Swedish giant killer isn't done yet. In modern warfare, the sharpest minds build the strongest shields. From surprise upstart to respected guardian, the Gripen has earned its place in aviation history. The Gripen is more than a jet. It's a symbol of national will and smart strategy. In uncertain times, the ability to keep fighting when main bases are gone is priceless. The Gripen's resilience and flexibility are more relevant than ever. Its ability to operate from roads and remote locations is a huge advantage in modern conflict. It lets countries build credible air forces without breaking the bank. The Gripen is a lesson in efficient, adaptable and affordable air power. It shows smaller nations can achieve world-class defense through smart design and independence. The Saab Gripen is proof that innovation can outshine brute force.